Ali Mikalka talks about why Hallmark's Sand Dollar Cove was perfect for her. Hallmark's latest summer night movie, Sand Dollar Cove, will be released on June 26 at 9 p.m. Eastern Time. Further, the movie includes Chad Michael and Ali Mikalka. Mikalka recently told TV Insider what it made sense for her to sign her first Hallmark project. The movie is shot in Mystic, Connecticut in March and April. Honestly, I was really excited to shoot in Mystic. I knew the little town because I had been there for a wedding years earlier, and I did really like the character of Ellie and I felt like I could do something with her. Mikalka told TV Insider. Murray, the co-star of Mikalka, added that although the location presented challenges, it also makes the shooting more intimate. Characters of Murray and Mikalka are two totally different worlds. Mikalka portrays the role of a real estate developer named Ellie in the movie. In the movie, she comes to San Dollar Cove to buy beachfront property, but the charming local Bodhi, played by Murray, owns a document and won't do hurry to sell his favorite dock. Calix, her character, is an urban girl who is passionate about work. When she meets Brody, he reminded her of some of the most important things to enjoy and celebrate in her life, such as family, friends, nature, food, and kind people. On the other side, Murray's character is dedicated to maintaining a small community. He's sad that his character Brody is an important part of the heart and soul of what Sand Dollar Cove is. He's very concerned about its values and history. Mikalka thinks Cowbell should restart. Fans of Mikalka, Bad Ali, and JJ still remember this musical duo in original Disney Channel movie Cowbells. The focus of the film is on two spoiled sisters who must find the value of a dollar while working on their father's dairy farm. Mikalka believes there is a possibility for a more adult sequel to the film. There is definitely a funny version of Cowbells 15 years later and the girls are maybe divorced or whatever and they're trying to keep the family business going, she told E.T. She thinks the film should have a more mature tone and wonders if the Disney Plus streaming platform would go for something more daring.